way easier to play Treant. Uh, you can be really obnoxious. That's a good point. The tune was forced off of the wave there, so Amar does get that range creep deny on the second wave. And kind of just owns the wave for now. So things, you know, you still have to give the Viper his space as the lane is going to be pushing. No shot V2 is going jungle. Or is he swapping? What is he doing? He is? What are they doing? Taking the gate this early. Is the, is the lane okay. already over? Uh, what is F he doing? He's, he's done. Afnin just down bottom with Brain Sap. Uh, they are... He's, he's jungling. Okay, this is... He's jungling, but he found the break creep, so he, he's even delayed down here. Crit's looking for him. Crit's like, uh, hello, Vatoon? Hello? Oh, this is strange. So they're just gonna give Solo the lane. It's his dream start. He's playing a tr maybe he wanted to be on Dying and get a solo lane, I guess, but I don't I don't know what the, this this is so what is this? Look, this is like someone griefing in my pubs. And Vatoon, yeah, Vatoon has the the ward up as well. So he's but gonna I, be able I, to I don't even know snake. how they managed to get back the lane this much. Like they couldn't even control it for two waves up there. <laughs> Like, this is unacceptable. Oh, man. All right. Go off, Pi. I mean, look, the, the camp is still blocked. Solo unblocked. No, the, the hard camp is blocked by his own ward, and he didn't get the sentry blocking the easy camp. Uh, okay, maybe Vatoon snipes a couple couriers here. That'd be pretty... No, he's going to keep it. Okay. Well. All right, we got level one jungle TA. Let's see. Let's see. Vatoon. And Solo's just sitting here and leeching. <laughs> he got auto attack by MR like four times. And he's like, I'm freaking out of here, man. Uh, absolutely no way. <laughs> and uh, so Amar's okay. He's TP in top now. Amar is just having a free time up here. Crit eventually actually managed to find Vatoon and force him to TP, and actually gets half the camp for his trouble. <laughs> this is I've, I've actually never seen this before. No, this is bizarre. All right, well, we'll see how that gets along for Ms. Ramses. is going to end up falling here. You might be able to get Snake for first blood, but no, not quite. And snaking out with the attendants will be able to lift it back just fine. Skitter finding first blood there. Uh, yeah, I'm just kind of speechless. It's a weird one for me, too. And look, Crit's back top lane. He took the gate, and he's just on harass TA duty. It's yeah. uh, going to go pretty well here. Let's see Crit Cam. Yes. Oh, yes. He's investigating. Investigator Crit. He's noticed a camp is missing from the Mighty Mines. And he's on his way to find justice for that family. <laughs> Batoon is getting his ass beat by a Centaur Conqueror. He's going to be forced back. <laughs> and he's going to body block a camp. He's going <laughs> to... Okay, TP down bottom as Ramses is getting a bit aggressive. Solo has completely abandoned the top lane. Amar has a free lane. Uh, he has absolutely no one to harass him here. Ramses yeah. is getting chased down by this mud golem that did hurl a boulder at him, but otherwise it's going to be just fine. I, I think Crit should just try lane down here now. I guess, right? Yeah. <laughs> like, Vitoon will get okay-ish farm jungling, but it won't be good. Now, I, I, I think this is a mistake to leave. You should stay. Bar bottom, though, I mean, it's going fairly well for Nine Pandas. They pick up a kill on a Snaking. Can't do, do too much about this mud golem this early on, but... The kill here is going to force, basically, Falcons to kind of commit to this try lane. Well, I say yeah, that, but Solo's uh, TPing top. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I wants that experience. I think Amar uh, might have seen him. Amar saw him TP in, though. And he's like, hello, my friend. But uh, let's see. What can he do about it? I don't know. It's a nice movement by Solo through the trees. A bit hard for Amar to actually catch him up there. And the shenanigans continue. Yeah, I mean they're only 1k ahead. It's not, it's not that bad. Yeah, but Amar's about to hit level six. You know, six minutes in, he's matching the GPM or sorry, XPM of of Malrin. Yeah, I mean that's a problem. But uh, oh. you get one kill on this viper and you're back. Uh, yeah, see how it goes. <coughs> well, crits back down bottom now, uh, but they can't find the range on the seed shot fast enough to be able to set Look up. Look here, they want stuff. the kill. They want the kill on Amar. Okay, they're gonna try. Yeah, Solo and Kiyotaka is here. Kiyotaka forced back. Amar, he's just dead. Throws out the uh, Viper Strike, but it's not gonna do a single thing here. Vatoon asking for the high five, and just like that, he's back to lane. The TA, the jungle TA, ganks the Viper. The true counter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not like it. It's not going that bad, you know? Okay, but here's the counterplay from Falcons. Malrin uh, kind of 
aggro the wave, let the wagon die. And he's here with level six with Snaking as well, who does get off that heavenly jump, prevents the hurl boulder from being too effective. That boulder, you know, as, as hard as he hurls it, it's not really all that fast. Snaking's gonna be able to tank a lot of uh, Kiyosaka's mana here, essentially. Does get the fortify committed. And Crit as well coming on through. They have another Warpine Raider come from the mid lane, tossing the Blood Grenade on oh, down. Miss Crit misses the stun, though. Oh, that might put him in a bad spot. And Malrin, oh, he's no. just dead. F Ninja collects his life with the Brain Sap. The tip there is now Snaking and Crit will go mano a mano here versus the Bane, who is eventually going to go down to Snaking's creep. The tower is going to go down, though. The Snay was too busy. Micro and the Warprine Raider didn't uh, tank for the wagon, so the tower's still alive. I guess that's kind of a win. Vatoon's back into the jungle. No, this is... Uh, it's a very hard game to play, because everything... is a bit of a, a trade there. Okay, but when you look at net worth, it's not really that bad. For nine pandas, like it, it kind of worked out. How are hero levels? Hero levels are just fine as well, honestly. The, the, the biggest Dyer's concern is Amar being level seven, but you have killed him once, right? So it's not like he's got a totally free game. Dyer's yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong. Like it's still, it's still not good for them, but. Oh, uh, I mean, if they lose. Like Ramses when you see here, your TA do what they did. Oh, yeah, oh. yeah. I think they're gonna end up losing Ramses. Nice dodge there onto the hoof stomp. Maybe that'll make a difference, but no. The double edge comes through, uh, and Skitter is going to collect the kill there. Solo's got really good XP as well. I mean, he picked up the Wisdom, so that goes a long way, but... This is... Okay. It's weird. It's really weird. Mm -hmm, Malrin's yeah. now coming down bottom. I think they're going to try and take this tower. He's already got in the mid one. Radiant Oscar. <laughs> this is just such a... Such a funny game that we uh, have found ourselves now. The tune up to level six, the three one one build, so he's just fine as far as refraction goes. And now he's just this is just regular TA now, I have to say. Yeah. I mean he's still uh what is it? Almost uh, one point five gold behind the Nagas. Um But like overall, like if you saw what the, if you only got to see two minutes of TA's early game, you would imagine it would be worse than this. That's that's fair. And uh, the fact of the matter is, it's it's gone much better. Has that has this come at the cost of anyone? Really, the biggest one to suffer. I mean, Crits did just get level four. He's getting now some some lane experience top. So on, yeah, I guess Spice. it's it's kind of fine all around. Maybe Ramsey's a little bit under leveled here. Skitter already up to level seven, but doesn't have a point for Song of the Siren. But a nice little hurricane out from the Wild Rig Ripper sees him out of harm's way. Amar now looking to turn. Should collect a kill here. Easy onto Ramsey, oh, but they will though. trade away Skitter as Kiyosaka completes his TP down bottom. Solo is going to be uh, making it a two for one special here. Goes to the tower, so the bounty split there. But Amar TPing in, collecting basically two kills in exchange for the life of the Naga. Gotcha. Damn, V2 is so annoying. Like, the second the Viper is out, he goes back there. It's like, oh, my lane. He's back. It's, you know, otherwise, uh, he doesn't want this game to show up on Dota buff as jungler. So he, <laughs> yeah. he, he needs to spend enough time in this top lane. He might be in for a little bit of trouble. Skitters here has the mirror image and is going to be able to at least get through the refraction. Crit may just die here. It's another stun in seven seconds. It's Kiyotaka who picks up a kill. I believe that's down bottom on a snaking. So they might just be able to get that tower. Dust is out, so he can't just meld and be safe. But he eventually, he's just going to be able to outrun the Naga Siren and her illusions. No, Nine Panas definitely, they made this game weird and it's, might, uh, might work, it's honestly. kind of working out. Yeah, I mean, Ramses Radiance is just uh, maybe 2k away now from his uh, Radiance. Really the worst thing. No, because the funny thing is you've seen, like the 10 minutes now, right? You've seen worse games from all of these heroes. Yeah. Uh, when they were played normally, you know what I mean? Yeah, and, you know, I've seen better games from a Viper off lane, right? So it's not like he's... Uh, maybe. I mean, he's up there. He's, he's yes. up there. He's rich, but he didn't, like, run into a lane where enemies fought him voluntarily, right? He's got one kill, <laughs> and he had a TP down bottom for it. And then Vitoon immediately yeah. got started farming in this top lane. Yeah, no, it's a secret strat. If you don't send any heroes for his Viper, he doesn't there's really... no one to lane against. Yeah. What can he do? What are you going to do? Poison attack the creeps? Yeah. Really uh, a super fun lane for him, but... You know, it's in fairness, you're right, not the worst one either. Snaking uh, already has, oh my god, the attendants out there, they're gonna overgrow with him, and oh my goodness, hit him with the Fiend's Crypt? That's just mean. I'm surprised he doesn't get any TPs to help him there. 
What's happening? Like, Insta Dragonite uh, Viper TP. Clean okay. those guys up. They won't move. He's got blink no. ready. No, Amar's going down bottom actually. He will trade the kill onto oh. Ramsey, so that's good, something. Good, good. I mean, this is a little bit more problematic now. He's feeling pretty good. Yeah. A second kill, especially a big one onto Ramsey's. Ramsey's, I don't know if he's the most ideal kill. It's between him and Zeus for sure. Uh, yeah. I mean, shutting down the Zeus would be nice, but uh, it's not that, especially without Stampede on Centaur. Yeah, that's true. About to get on top of him. Amar might have another kill. There is a nightmare for Afro Ninja. This is it to almost dodge the attack. You oh. almost died there. Oh. That was really close. It means they don't oh, have a living armor here for Batoon, so he's gonna go down. I mean, I don't think living armor saves him there, to be honest. Oh, but... and sleep mid. Now they're putting uh -oh. on that aggression. Yeah, here it comes. The gas is being hit here as the acceleration from the Team Falcons off this Malrean Blink Dagger, collecting two kills onto two cores. Not bad at all. Ramsey's made negative progress Rappi, towards his, uh, al his uh, radiance here in the past couple minutes. Kiyotaka does get off. Actually, a lot of damage here onto Skitter, who goes down. It's traded to five, the uh, Brain Sap from Apple Ninja. So it's something, but you did just lose three cores in the span of, what, like 30 seconds? Yeah. That's... Dude, this dude deals so much damage, man. He's a little crazy. I mean, uh, Phylactery goes a long way for sure, but yeah. it's also just Zeus with levels. No, but it's this, this like 10 to 15 minutes, like it's, he almost kills the entire team, you know what I mean? Like two Arc Lightnings and Ultimate. It's, it's a lot. Just what I Radiance top tower oh, is nice advantage top. for Falcons building up yet again in this kind of a game for them. At this point now, Snake King's even starting to build a little bit of a net worth lead. Getting really too close, I would say, to Ramsey's net worth. Who is, you know, <laughs> in fairness yeah, to Ramsey, an alchemist. <laughs> he's sitting on 3,000 gold. Uh, Snake King, obviously, with uh, already a medallion. He, so his far, like his gold is more effective than Alks at this point, right? Which is why he's actually closing the gap faster than Ramsey's can build it, despite yeah. having Grievel's Greed. <laughs> That's funny. This is the last tier one tower, though. Falcon's Dyer's eager to accelerate this game and attack. close off the map. It's actually Skitter, without not Song of the Siren, is breaking Dyer's the smoke here. Top nice top blink top. to cancel the beam script that was being channeled by Afro Ninja, but that allows Solar to just walk in up. Finds three on the overgrowth. They burst through Snaking as well as Kiyotaka might be in for a third kill here. Look how they slow him to a crawl. Amari's able to get a solo kill onto Ramsey on the other side of the map, but it'll be two cores dead for Team Falcons as nine pandas smoke up and do find themselves a fight here. Yeah, no, I think Falcons are just so weirded out. Like, it's hard for them to play. Like, it's hard to focus when your enemy is playing like this. You don't know what's going on. And, like, look at this Zeus's top net worth. Like, he's an absolute monster. I like how you said that they're, they're weirded out. They're playing some disgusting Dota. We'll take another look at that fight here. I mean, damned if you do, damned if you don't, right? You find a stun onto uh, the gripping target, but that just frees up Solo to find a really nice overgrowth. Yep. No, uh, like running into Zeus without pipe, you're, you're going to die. That's really Zeus running into you in that case. I almost can't blame <laughs> Falcons because he was in that smoke. He wanted to fight. Yep. And now Ramsey's uh, with the Relic online is, is fine. He's starting to get a little bit uh, activated here as far as his farm goes. Radiance very soon. But in the meantime, Falcons are going to look for a little bit more aggression as they smoke to try and find someone top. They won't see anyone here. And in fact, they saw both Vatoon and Kiyotaka. Vatoon is going to go into the triangle here. This could be problematic for him as they will get him. Does get off that refraction before uh, the stuff comes through. Good nightmare there to save him a little bit. But Amar, he's committing for the kill. Careful here, Kiyotaka throwing down these arc lightnings with the phylactery on top. He's got Amar to half HP. Snaking, maxing these nature's attendants, though, will be able to heal him up pretty well. As he just vaults over the cliff, he'll be just fine. It's a lot of mana burn. I don't think they can contest these Ancients, so they'll end up going to Kiyotaka as he continues to extend his net worth lead this game. Oh, he doesn't have enough mana to farm it, though. Yeah, yeah they even brought the Naga over to farm these Ancients. Need some illusions. Uh, so, actually... Yeah, this was a really, really good move by Falcons. Couldn't let them just farm this for free. Nature, attend us! Now Amar's actually going to be able to get these alongside Snake, and he might have grabbed a couple of those. 
Solar Crest fully online, Hurricane Pike fully online. Maybe you get snaking here, but not much else. You've lost the stack quite painfully. Thought maybe they were gonna be able to get up. You're right, just not having the mana there, even with the fairy's trinket. But the Deso's online for Vatoon. So his anonymization's just fine. No blink dagger in the quick buy. It's not really that kind of a game for him. He needs that BKB ASAP. But the Blink Tiger's yeah. online and ready for crit. So I don't think this Falcon's aggression is going to stop too soon. No. I mean, the three man the three man team here Alpha Ninja, Kyotaka, Solo, smoked up trying to find something, but Falcons are they're basically playing together now. They are. Going for towers. I think Ramsey's. Denying is... Ancients. Maybe close to joining team fights. He has Radiance done at least. He's had it for a while and into the BKB immediately for him. But he's showing on the map. Amar and Crit eager to make their way over there. They have Stampede and the Viper Strike at the ready. Solo going on through. His smoke's broken by Snake King, but they have managed to find Ramses here already. He is broken, slow to a crawl, going absolutely nowhere. Kiyotaka is able to escape, he takes the gate down bottom, so maybe not the worst thing that could have happened. You didn't lose both of your important cores. Yeah. Ramses is getting very punished though. Like it, it's rough to be an alchemist and you're the lowest net worth core. Like yep. You know you're not having a good game at that he's, point. He's 0, 7, and 4. I mean, he is <laughs> not having a good game. My god. Uh, yeah, quite the opposite timing of his uh, last game. And uh, Falcons keeping the pressure up, immediately sieging this tier 2 tower. You do have this stream protector with max living armor, so Solo really slowing down these pushes early on. Especially because, especially without Shard, this Viper just doesn't... I mean, he's okay at pushing, right? But with all this bonus armor you're getting now, 10 bonus armor onto a tier 2 tower, it's tough. And the healing, of course. I mean, the ants and the ants will help a lot. Like these, uh, these yeah. creeps hit very hard. That's true, actually. Down bottom, the three-man team, as you call it, is able to take down a tier two tower. Mid lane in Ramsey's. trouble is just ramped. He's just farming a bit too deep here. Can they take him down in time? It might cost the life of Crit. Oh, the nightmare. I thought they saved him, but the damage still ends up coming through now. But Dune ends up jumping in very aggressively. Saw the siren to cancel a Fiend's grip. They're still looking for more now from down south. Solo joining this fight. Can't really change much. Try as he might as Skitter joining this fight with confidence now. That Orc and Malevolence, the Master Style of the Illusion, staring through nine pandas. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, they thought they could caught them, catch them off guard there again. But now Falcons, they're they're done. You know, they don't wanna they don't wanna feed. They all they all join up when these fights occur. Yeah, and a really nice cast there, Song of the Siren, really stopping what could have actually been a, a pretty good kill threat there. DK out of position, so he couldn't actually find his stun. We'll take another look at it here. And that suits just so much damage, but not yeah. nearly enough. No, no, I'm pretty sure the VQ was dead here. Not pretty, yeah. yeah. Really nice song. Just a short and sweet one, right? Snake King joining that fight. Uh, really nice connection. All Up Ninja can do is really just hit the D ward at least before he dies. And once again, Kiyotaka making it out, but eventually, especially with Stampede as a way to always get on top of the Zeus, it's, it's just not going to really be enough here. No, you need people to die immediately when you press your spells. If they survive, like, <laughs> you're in trouble. It's going to be death number eight for Ramses in 20 minutes on an alchemist. The tune, not looking so hot either. Zero, three, and four for him. Um, oh, they're trying to do a sneaky little yeah, Roche player. little Roche play. I mean, without song for 30 seconds, it's doable. The tune's going to be able to get, I think he's going to get He's going to get knocked? Oh, that's close. <laughs> So he's got double melts with the Death Oak. It's, it's going explode. fast. Now can they get here in time, though? That's, that's going to be the biggest question. With the smoke buff, Elder Dragon form active, Blink Dagger. They're going to be too late. Rob says no one's going to go. We have to get on the Stampede. Oh, the Bash onto the Tune. Okay, down it goes. They did get a stun onto the Tune. Oh, oh. big stomp there. Onto three from Crit. It's Mayhem in the pit at nine pandas. They're going to end up being extinct here. Crit once again dies for the good of his team as Vitoon respawns, just surrounded by Naga Sirens. Dashed upon the racks and down he goes. Falcons will be able to punish a very aggressive Roche attempt from Nine Bandits.
Yeah. And it was hard. When you see them charging there, it's hard to see this ending up any other way. Like, yeah. Ram says he knew. Immediately keeping <laughs> out. Yeah, it's going to be uh, one of the first times that uh, Kiyosaka dies outside of the laning stage. And I think that may be a sign of things to come. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think this game should be clearer. Okay, so they have the Anxious completed pipe. I think they need Ag Shard on Viper and Heart on Naga, and they should be able to like start threatening the base. Yep. Those illusions. Like, there's no point in delaying this game forever. As well. No, no, no. I, I think quite the opposite, right? It, I think it looks pretty scary, because you know Alchemist. For I mean, admittedly, he's having a terrible game. He's doing worse than the Jungle Vitune TA versus Viper, right? <laughs> yeah. That's. I mean, it's not his fault. He's just commonly the target. He is the offlaner after all, so he kind of has to take the dangerous farm. It's just the nature of that position. Uh, but he's having a bad game. Nevertheless, he's still an alchemist. Like, you give him a little bit of space, and look at those these early items, and maybe that's enough. The net worth lead being 10k, it's, it's significant. And Skitter, I mean, he's almost got that heart already. All right. I mean, I don't know. I'm already kind of talking my way out of this. I don't know if Ramsey's ever has a game here, Pi. No, they need to get some lucky, Not maybe not a wipe, but like they get to farm the map for free for like a minute. Then, uh, then they have a chance. Because right now it's hard. But I hope Falcons are like thinking about how they're going to breach this high ground. Because they should not do do it like they did game one. No, no. They... Like it's, it's fine. You don't even have... You could even wait for the next ages. I'm fine with that. But just... I hope they're like they have a plan, but they seem to be gathering up here. I think they're going to be going and at least trying to force these TPs back with Ramsey's and Matute comfortably farming. Not a position they are too eager to be in. The problem is, if they don't commit, Kiyotaka is just going to kill all the creeps or illusions that go to the tower, and Solo is just going to heal yep. the tower back to full. Like the, this, this kind of poke is just not going to cut it, right? Ramsey's is still no. farming down bottom. Um, they're just too comfortable here. Yeah. No, I think. Uh... Like if someone finds, like if Vitune or uh, Ramses finds a spot on the map to farm, I think they'd rather have their racks fall than coming back. Look, like the... I mean, you have a tier two up, right? So you can't even get megas. Oh no! Is is that the courier with BKB on it? Oh no! That that's tough. Okay, Vitune has his, but not having the dual the dual BKB reveal does hurt. Yes. Oh, could... that's sloppy to send that out. Snipe by Naga. You, you kind of, in a game like this, you really need all your resources, don't you? Not yes. having that one, I mean... Amar is about to finish up his Scythe of Ice, uh, and then he's very close to the Ag Shard on top. Yep. Wait, this is... The Snap Pandas, are they looking for a fight here? You can be ready for Vitune. You have only level 1 Fiend's Grip. Oh, they're just kind of out here to protect V2, and it looks like they're not really eager to fight yet. But if they could collapse upon Amari, he's pretty separated from his team. No wards outside the base for them in this part of the map, making that a challenge, but... Is there any kind of opening here? Man, poor V2 in both games just kind of being relegated to getting the scraps of whatever exists on the map. He's not dared show in the lane. He stepped out of his base, and he's just been on this new Horizons part of the there. map, you know? Yeah. Uh, Solo shows for one second. Yeah, I mean, that's, 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 that's what'll happen, right? BKB, TP, sure, you'll live, but you're not going to accomplish much of anything at all down here. Oh, and Vitun, uh, Vitun Pardon actually able to get through the enemy tormentor is not bad at all. That Berserk Potion's okay for Ramses. Gives himself a Dispel. Dyer's middle but now mid... Oh, well, actually, all three lanes are starting to shove in. This might force a reaction here. Again, the Illusions alone aren't going to cut it, as Kiyotaka is just going to be able to clear the waves. At the cost of his own mana. Ooh, Maybe it was a bait, though. V2. They want V2. Yeah, and Crit gets on top BKB. of it. But a really clutch BKB there from V2. Not risking anything, he gets out of there. Problem is, Naga is like farming all your camps. So you TP back to base, and then you have to do that the same run as run across the map. Yeah. All around the woods. You don't really have a lot of farm either on that path. I mean, he, he's going to start back to the new frontier side of the map, back top lane. No TP or BKB for over a minute. Zeus ulti. Vision of some heroes in the mid lane. The skitter is going to send the illusions to. Well, actually, cut the waves. 
Nice little play by Snaking. He's cutting this top wave with his creeps, just kind of pulling them to the Naga Siren. Yeah. So Nine Pandas, they're not even able to shove these waves out. DD spawned in the river. And Ramses... No, I, I, think, I think they they, they want to act short on Viper. It makes sieging way easier. But as you said, like it's always annoying when Asus is there is spamming you. Yeah. Especially tree and feeling the power. <laughs> I mean, look it. It's been slow sieges. It's, it's another kind of wacky, crazy game, but Nine Pandas... Uh, especially with their shenanigans here at the start, they've proven that they can take these games. Uh, Katoon's right back where he just was in the same position. DKB in 10 seconds. You know, these. this is kind of what oh, his game Ramses. has to look like. He knows. Now there's a ward here. They know where Ramses is. Amar making the jump on forward with that Scythe device reveal. He's going to end up. No, doesn't stun himself because he gets off the BKB just beforehand. But Epa Ninja unable to find a Fiend script surrounded. Solo forced to utilize the Overgrowth just to stop Crit from chasing him down. And Kiyotaka steps off the high ground. He is going to regret that. Snake and puts him in the dirt with a spear. Has buyback here, but Mallory needs to drop a tip onto Kiyotaka. Just kind of overextending there. And with his DD rune on Mallory. This base is about to be opened up. Yeah. Yeah, no creep cutting. I don't know how you... Can't really defend this. There's definitely nope. one Rex down. I mean, Seuss is respawning soonish, I guess. Yeah. But... He's got that second fortify now after the first tier 3 tower goes down. I'd still expect one tower to drop here. You do have Chemical Rage in five, but no BKB to follow suit with it. Vitoon still has basically everything he could ask for. Zeus is respawning, yeah. does have himself a buyback as well. Things really start getting desperate here, which at this stage is maybe kind of realistic. But it looks like just the bottom lane for now. Falcon's eager to apply some pressure mid, but it doesn't really seem like they're going to be able to commit there as Ramses just cleans up these creeps for free. So let's see if they're just going to wait for the Roche now, or if they want to try and under siege. Well, what are you, what are you in danger of here? Would be my question, right? Like, what's, what's going to be problematic? This TA shard is annoying, but not the end of the world. And Ramses, I mean, is he dead he, again? He might just be dead. Actually, really good initiation. The double stuns, and they just get him. No, actually, still be able to live. Just. Barely the Berserk Potion. All the HP regen coming in clutch here. Zeus will see already utilized as they do have Apo Ninja dead to right here with the Viper Strike. Down he goes and now on top of it, yeah. dude, immediately. Ay, ay, ay. GG is called. Didn't even get the, get the BKB off this time. Amar returning the favor from game one. Look at the smiley faces. Oh my god, Amar. You hit him with the Viper and then you, you drop that many smileys. My man. No, I, I get it. I don't want to be too harsh, but this is one of the strangest Dota games uh, <laughs> I've ever seen. I, I don't know.